because that is when we are going to ask you to use that voice. We're going to ask you to use that voice to come to Albany. Not by the hundreds, sisters and brothers, but we are going to ask you to come to Albany by the thousands. We are going to ask you to come to Albany to cry out with one voice. We are going to ask you to come to Albany to fight for the future of public education, a fight that is about celebrating, not demonizing educators. A fight is about supporting quality in higher education, not pathways that lead to nowhere. It is a fight about informative assessment, not about the tyranny of obsessive standardized testing. It will be a fight about pupils and teachers, not piercing and testing. It will be a fight about professionalism and privacy, not in bloom and wireless generation. It will be a fight about our schools and our children, not about corporations and billionaires. It will be a fight about fairness and equity, not about tax caps and shell games. It will be about dreamers and the DREAM Act, not about denying access to children and immigrants. It will be a fight about truth, not about the lies suffer every day. It will be a fight about the future of public education and getting it right. 2013, it's your fight, it's your fight, it's our fight. 2013 marks a decade since we last called on you to come to Albany on a Saturday in the spring to deliver a message in mass. On June 8th, we are asking you to come back and to speak with one voice, to say enough is enough, to take back public education. You have earned it, you have deserved it. Speaking with one voice, we will be heard. The time has come. We need you there on June 8th. Will you be there on June 8th? We need you to bring many others. Will you bring many others with you on June 8th? We'll be there. Will you be there to speak with one voice? Will you be there to speak truth to power? Will you be there to speak for public education, to speak for the fight for public education? Sisters and brothers, I know you will, and I thank you for that support. God bless you all.